There are military leaders who need no advice, who evaluate things themselves and decide to spam heavy tanks. Their entourage has to only carry things out. But these are stars of the first order, which are barely produced once in a hundred years. In the majority of cases, the commander of an army will not wish to dispense with spamming heavy tanks in the forest while water meta. And that was said by Moltke the Elder in 1859. This is me playing Frago. And um, yeah, I'm just going to set myself to invisible on Discord. So I think that stops me from receiving notification pings. So this is the Frago mod. It's made by Gunther S and the friends of Gunther S. And it changes a lot of things. So I'm just trying to make a deck. I don't know what's going on. And then after the game, I can still hear the ping. I can still hear the bloop sound. I apologize. I realize that must be really annoying for you because you think you're getting a Discord message. But you're not. <laughs> I've been given a quick rundown. Basically, fobs are 150 point and have 25 damage. Infantry kills each other faster. I've noticed the CVs have much higher availability than they used to. Prices here seem similar, apart from the, the fob. On the Infotab, FS Jaeger now come in the helicopter supply, uh, helicopter option, and they'll still keep their airborne forward deployment, so that's really interesting. I think that's going to be quite strong. And I also get more FS Jaeger than I used to, so five in a card at Max Vet, and two cards of regular, one card of Metis, and the machine gunner guys, I'm going to try bringing them as well and see how they do. Believe the faggots better. Might be wrong on that. The pioneers now come with grenade launchers, so 425 meter range is interesting. So I wanted to bring that and see how that goes. And I've got regular mot shots and everything with an AT GM on it has been increased in price. So I'm bringing them without the AT GMs. Artillery. I've been told that rocket art is better now. I've been told that the smirch is good, and I've also been told that dispersion changes with increase range so I want to check that out. Standard motors, standard D20s, actually I'm going to get rid of these so that I can afford to fill out my inf tab with a bit more mot shots and great and um, the supply cost of this has definitely come down. I don't know what else has happened with the rate of fire and stuff but I've been told that Rocket Arty is good now, hopefully I didn't miss this one. Um, thanks not sure much has changed here. This seems a lot like the vanilla tank tab. Uh, all, uh, most of the stats seem the same from a preliminary look. Recon, this is interesting. So see, these guys at the bottom are three availability at max vet, and now they're four, which I think makes them worth bringing. And really interestingly, these guys come in an MI-24D. So yeah, sure, I'll take four extra MI-24D. Then I've got uh, standard Alf Clowler and an MI2 recon helicopter. I've noticed, um, I don't know if this has changed actually. So Cubs, the Igler has better accuracy. I'm pretty sure this is like 45% in vanilla. I might be wrong again. And this is a forward deployed Igler. So that's really good news. You get forward deployed stuff, uh, forward deployed AA and forth. That's a really good idea. And the Shilka, seems better seems really good now i'm pretty sure the aim time has been reduced also i forgot to mention aim time on rocket launches has been set down to one second again i believe it's uh two in vanilla helicopter tab not much seems to have changed here everything seems the same prices seem to say maybe the prices are, are less i don't know if this was 140 or maybe that's right Air tab, this all seems really similar as well. So I'm ready to rumble. And I'll be playing up against Gunther, head dev of Frago mod. And then we'll see how it goes and see what's going on. Oh, yeah, I forgot to mention siege ranges have been buffed as well. So that's fantastic news. I've been told the maximum siege range is 6 kilometers. So we'll see how that goes. And, uh, yeah, apart from that, this is basically how I build my fourth now. Anyway, with the exception of this infantry tab, which is wacky right um i've been told that inf kills other inf a lot faster but yeah it'll be really great to see how much damage i can do with these forward deploy helicopter troops because that is a big gameplay change just been sent a list of changes with second uk that's what i asked gunther to play because he said it, that was the other division that's been changed the most um 
Harrier travel time's been reduced to three seconds. Harriers have a better turn radius now. Phantoms can target helicopters. This, this is really good stuff. Um, second ID AA works. That's good to hear. One extra SAS squad. That's really interesting. Two extra chalies and Cedar added to second ID. So lots of changes. And he said that's not an exhaustive list. One extra SAS squad I think is going to make them really strong. But, um, but we'll see. I mean, they, they were, in my opinion, they're the weakest team in the game right now. So I can understand. Big changes, but yeah, Harry is getting a good turn radius. That's amazing. And um, I do wonder what the loss miss bug that has been fixed is. And them getting seed is really interesting because they're a helo bond division. So once they get seed, they can suppress enemy AA positions easy, more easily. Huh. So yeah, let's uh, let's see how that goes. Oh yeah, one one more change I noticed is that uh, obviously this as an ATGM carrier has gone up in price, right? And so well, you know, I don't want that anymore. So I've gone for the TO fifty five instead. The stats on this still seem the same. And another point I missed was that the BRM one. It's 55 now instead of 70. It was too expensive at 70 IMO, in my opinion. Uh, yeah, I'm looking forward to using these rocket artists and seeing how good they are now. Generally, artillery is a bit better. Like, this was like 3.2 or 3.4 in vanilla. 3.7 in this. Uh, I don't know if that's changed. I can't remember the values. I can't remember what the values used to be. This looks the same though, apart from the supply cost, uh, but with the FOB being so much cheaper and harder to kill now, I can definitely get my money's worth. I was hoping maybe I could, yeah, maybe I could get rid of the TO, and then that will actually allow me to get another card of RM70s, and we can really abuse the FOB. Because 600 for 80 rounds, and what is 1600 supply? So... That's like 20 volleys, 20 full racks. So yeah, I think I can keep four going. It's more than 20. It's about 30. I think it's about 30. So can I bring two fobs? <laughs> no, I can't. I think it's about, about 30 salvos. So with four and the reload time and the fact that it doesn't shoot 80 missiles at once, at least it doesn't in vanilla, I think will be good. Can't wait to try out my RM70s. Let's go. Okay, so we're in game, and uh, yeah, I'm looking forward to this. I get lots of RM70, and they are cheaper, and I have been told that they fire faster. So get that fob down. Oh, that's interesting. So because it's got 25 HP now, and the max is usually 10. I think we've got a small visual thing there, I'm not sure. Gunther can do anything about that. This is Gunther S. Calls himself Comrade Kermit in game. So you see that. Let's get these guys up. I get the forward deploy in the recon helicopter. So that's really interesting. Um, is it fair? I don't know. I've not played yet. <laughs> One thing to note is that the, the basically the, the shorter the distance, the more advantageous it is to actually bring a truck. But um, yeah, we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens with his AA and stuff. I don't know if he gets for deployment AA. I've, I've heard that Harry's are better, so maybe he'll open Harrier. This has gone up in price. This used to be two fifteen. It's two four five now, same as the tornado. Fair enough. And. Um, yeah, you only need one card of CVs and the logi type to get four CVs. So how many CVs am I running? Please tell me it's more than four. Okay, I'm running four CVs, so I'm still going to have to be quite careful. Uh, and uh, yeah, standard, standard fourth opening, I guess. Although, I do want to try out these helicopters a bit more, see how well we can do with them. And now that I can back it up with forward deployed AA... I'm thinking, and the Igles are better.
I wonder if that's his coat. I told him not to. <laughs> yeah, we'll see. I mean, I think I'm a pretty powerful gamer. I also don't understand sarcasm. So, we're going to try and take this basically using our uh, well, deployed heli guys. I mean, I feel like that's something that you can't do in vanilla. And we'll try out the, the guys with the three MGs as well. And yeah, we kept the Metis in the trucks for better or for worse. But yeah, I think I can get to here. And then, you know, we need to stop him from reinforcing it. So that's where these SPG9s come in. Oh, I've got no points. Okay, maybe not. <laughs> Uh, let's get rid of the CV as well and just go uh, like this. And yeah, I want to reinforce on this side, although I do want to try out these Pioneer Grenade Launcher guys, and I do wonder if there's any point in this. You can't be strong everywhere, right? So let's move this guy to here. Try and get him back there. And... Yeah, we'll just hold on this side, so... A couple of pioneers with these grenadiers. I noticed they've got two pen, but I think the satchels do as well. Usually you wouldn't be able to hit it from here, right? But now that it's... 425 meters, maybe they will hit from there. And, uh... Yeah, I wanted an RM70, but... I mean, this is now very risky, but who cares? All right, I'm ready. I've noticed my air tab is bigger. <laughs> and I've noticed my income's really low. Oh, no, hang on. 65 times 4. So it's the same, but you get you get income every 15 seconds instead of every, you know, every minute. But it's the same income. Uh, yeah, interesting. Interesting mod. I mean, it's great that uh, there is mod support. I know it's broken for a while. And then we got an update that fixed it, and all anybody could say was, well, why didn't you fix other thing instead? But uh, yeah, we're not going to go with this. We're going to get an FS Jäger Metis into here. So he does get the SAS, so there's a good chance that everybody's going to die. But 6 HP should mean, unless he's changed the HE, which I don't think he has. There's no way of knowing. Uh, these guys will survive one hit each. But maybe they won't uh, land and then start whacking people, which is what happens in in uh, in vanilla. Interesting. So this has 85 rockets in-game, but 80 on the tab. Not sure of the accuracy. Oh yeah, I've been told actually that um, this now changes with. Oh, it's beautiful. Look at that. We've only been asking for that for like since since launch, uh, since EA launch. Do you see? It gets bigger with distance, so you now have an incentive to move your stuff around. And you know, do you want big dispersion or do you want uh, do you want high accuracy? Right, because at this range, you know, you probably nail that house. But here I can cover this entire area that I think he's going to open into. Let's put it like there. So yeah, I'm very hyped. Firing it from next to the fob, obviously not very intelligent. But uh, I don't mind. And yeah, we've got the MiG-29 AA, which perhaps, perhaps not intelligent. I mean, we're very weak on this side. We only have one Pioneer over here. But I'm hoping I bamboozle him enough that uh, he doesn't roll my flanks, but if he does, he does. Three Igglers. I mean, this is to kill the helicopters that I think are going to come for me. Maybe I don't need that because of the MiG-29. But uh, I've made my bed and now I shall lie in it. 
Presumably that means he's ready. Right, so I'm pretty sure I'm going to get there pretty fast. I mean, I, I've got forward deploy and the helicopters. And this is... 28 second aim time. It doesn't seem like it. Oh, no, hang on. It has been 28 seconds. I just... Uh, yeah, you, can, you can count it up here. It, it is. It's about right. That's cool. This fires a lot faster. Still suffers from the vanilla game tracer issues. Oh, whoops. All my guys are dying. So I lost two in one pass, which isn't fantastic. That's a testament to the Harrier's increased agility. And I did have a fighter to stop that, but I uh, I messed up. Let's hotkey this spread boy. Um, yep, so the SAS are already out. So yeah, we lost a lot of guys. We'll see if he survives. If vanilla, he would. Though he only survived with one HP. So I think that's less than vanilla, and he died pretty fast. So that's good stuff. Our our attack has, you know, it seems to have worked. It's interesting. I'm losing guys on the flip side. and must have some assess up here. I don't have any recon. Which is obviously a me problem. And we could do with uh, you know, reinforcing a little bit on these sides. It's interesting, I can buy a buy one of these every 15 seconds now. I can buy an SPG-9 every 15 seconds. Cool. Test. Is this thing working? I can't tell if it's working when I, when I don't have the preview enabled. Uh, whatever. If it doesn't, I'll just recast it. So, we're in over here, and yeah, this thing is going to keep it shooting. Whatever, I don't care. It's very cheap. <laughs> and now... Yeah, it's still the same speed and everything, but I've got three Eagles, so I think I'm going to be okay. Oh, yeah, so... The suppression on near miss on the on the man pads, he told me. So do you see how that routed, even though... So did you see? They're taking cohesion damage. It's really good. It's really good. Big fan. So there's suppression on miss, which we've been waiting for for a while in vanilla. Uh, I don't know how how much I can move up really on the in the air now if at all. But yeah, people are definitely dying faster. Like you see, he's getting suppressed from the misses. Good stuff. Ah, so you see, he died there. He wouldn't have died in vanilla. This man's dying to something you can't see. He's probably a sniper or something. Uh, I am being pushed out, which isn't ideal. And yeah, we're just going to have to leave. There's no way out. See if we can... Uh, do a bit of standoff with these bad boys. I need some recon over here, really. I don't know if... Uh, if those guys were changed at all. That sniper's still up. I don't know how good they are in this either. They're good in vanilla. Very good in vanilla. He's finally in. Yeah, you see these guys are dying, whereas usually they'd survive. That colour's changed. Let's still aim second to seconds. Um, oh, but, but yeah, these guys shooting one now. Is it, is it 2.5 in vanilla? I think it is, yeah. Now I've got this problem where, you know, I want to... Is that javelin still alive? Basically, is the question. Kill that guy with this. I need some uh, recon, and I'll get it with an Mi-24D because I can. And yeah, we got that sniper. Whoa. The accuracy on the laws has gone up. It was this 37 in vanilla. That's my. They got counter batteries. Yeah, it did. <laughs> Pressing my hotkey, I was like, why is it not working? But yeah, I got kind of bad. My bad. Don't want to get shot by that. Yeah, so he died to that thing that I can't see. Oh, no, I'm flying over all his AA. This isn't smart. Yeah, that was very unsmart. Unintelligent. So he's got more there. Soften that up. 
Ah, I need, need a bit more recon. Oh, don't have a recon helicopter. I thought I'd bought one, but either it died or... Yeah, there you go, see, so you got hit by car battery. These don't have the ATGM because the ATGM one was 10 points more and I don't see the points they're going to die. So we'll have to rely on these ATGMs to see us through. We've still got our Igler's alive, I don't know if he knows. But, um, yeah, I'm going to struggle to win that without an ATGM. Oh, his has an ATGM. Uh, okay, we've got a lot of points now. And yeah, we're going to try attacking over here. So first I need some, some recon. A few tanks. A bit of infantry. A bit of supply. Terrier pioneers. Ah, so they've got this grenade launcher thing, so maybe we'll see what that's worth. So does it just behave the same way except now it's got more range? Yeah, it seems that way. So the, the HE... Oh no, the HE's gone down a lot. So that's reasonable. Like it, it's 2 HE in, for the satchels. Oh no! I didn't get money for that. I did buy two. I'm lagging a little bit. I'll apologise for that. I don't think it's on my side, but sometimes it is. Challenger 3... Oh, I think I got side shot on that. That looked unpleasant. And uh, yeah, let's attack down here as well, because we can. And uh, yeah, here we go. So are we in grenade range? No, but he's got a grenade as well, so I don't really want to be. Ah, that's going to mess me up though. So it looks like we're not going to be attacking there, we're going to be defending the foreseeable future. Hope we finally find this sniper. Might as well heal this guy up. Ow. So I don't actually have any AA because my mate died. I was just relying on that. So we'll try out these upgraded chilkers. Thankfully this guy was landed in time. And yeah, these guys have the grenade launch as well. So maybe we'll finally see that. See, he says it's under attack, but it's a sniper, right? So that's why I can't see it. So I need to, uh, yes, yeah, coming from this building. There we go. So we can see him now. No, don't leave. It's not, it's not what I want, really. Whatever, we're Max Vet. Just run at him. <laughs> Might as well try and get that. That range. It's kind of hard to miss. Uh, get some more standoff. It's chasing me. <laughs> so, these seem better as well now. Yeah, the HE is almost twice as good. I think it is twice as good. Makes them a bit more useful. Now at least we know there's no javelins down here. What's going on over here? See if we can supply this guy without him dying. I don't know if he's still got this line set up. I'm in minimal range. Can my grenade launcher shoot this? Let's find out. I mean, it's got two pet. Ah, okay. No, you need to get a javelin still or HE. So we should be okay. If we can get that, no, don't you do that. Oh no! Ah, I think we'll be okay. Blimey, I mean, he's going in deep. If I can kill that, that's good. I'm for 15 though. Alright, so I get quite lucky with the missiles though. I don't have any ECM or anything. Wow. Okay. Oh, there's an SS hit. Right, well that explains that. <laughs> so I got hit by additional rounds there that I didn't anticipate. But, uh, yeah, we're gonna get ourselves over here. 
Nice, right, Marty. Now, I really want another RM70. I'm going to have to remember to move it this time. Let's not spread these guys out. Don't have any AA on this side either. Uh, we know there's an SAS round here. Ah, okay. I'm not going to win that fight. That's interesting. So I've been told the smirch works now, so we're going to have to wait for smirch. Check that. It's upsetting. Probably get counter battery, but <laughs> you do it. And uh, yeah, I don't know. I don't see that SS anymore. This gets 6 HP, so. Get another one of these, and then. Right. That's not good. I believe I've shown side armor there. So, can't afford to do cool stuff. We have to defend our borders, or we're going to lose. Def definitely tell the difference with the law. He's got seed out. And yeah, I'd lost that zone because I didn't have a CV in it. So he's plus two now. Uh, I'm trying to reverse him, but he's not having a good day. Move this over here, I suppose. I mean, he's still got that SS over there, but I don't know where it is. So. It's interesting that he's these guys have unloaded here. I probably told them to to get the SS. Gonna, ah, there he is. Uh, I lost my other AA, didn't I? So he's doing that to get my heli guys that are coming. So we can't get in that way. I can hear his guys getting shot. Or is he going? Yeah, he's getting my helicopters. Shoot them. This grenade launch is pretty good, man. Let's see how they deal with the. I need to get back in my zone or I'm going to lose the game. That should be uh, leading me up here. But with those Harriers being as good as they are now, it's a lot harder to do so. Wow. Okay. That was a lot of damage. So yeah, he's ahead of me now. Uh, Ah, okay, so I can't cross that, because that Milan's still there. Another recon. Need a recon. Let's get this guy behind here. Should, should keep me alive for a bit. We got the SAS. Oh, okay, so we moved the CV back out. That challenge is still up. Oh, I shouldn't have moved that the way for it to, uh... Okay, it died and I don't know what killed it. <laughs> Probably some of these people. Let's do some unloading. Ah, that's a bomber, isn't it? Like cluster bomber or something. No, it's a Phantom F3. Is it any faster now? No, it's not. <laughs> That's a shame I'm revealing to, uh... Do these guys go slower through the forest, or am I... Am I wrong? Pretty sure it's going slower through the forest. Over here, it's really not going very well for us. I think we got that SS, though, so that's good. Not many CVs left in the tank. I'm pretty sure vehicles go slower in forests. I'm going to have to ask him after this. Chinook supply. wonder if it uses fuel. And yeah, I'm just getting tired by these uh, 
Linkses and stuff. I don't know if the LOS has changed, like, usually you wouldn't be able to see that. Alright, so he's got... Oh yeah, because he gets two cards of SAS, I remember now. <laughs> So I don't know how I feel about that, but I've only played one game, so it's, it doesn't really make any sense to offer too much criticism. At least we've taken this for a given value of taken. I mean, he's just moved his CV over to here now, so not the most useful thing ever. Okay, I had a tank here, but it died. That's a shame. That's not the CV because it wasn't in the zone. Get back on that. Let's hit that with a bomb and see how it goes. I could never afford another another RM70. It's a shame. What can you do? Seed again. Eats three igloos though, it's not very lucky. That guy eats a couple of stingers as well. So at least we know there's SAS over there as well. Now, move these up to five position range like, so we can help with that. It's really difficult to sort this out. I've run out of ASFs, you see. Need some supply for these guys. Uh, we've got Shulker, that should be enough. Know, does he see that? No, he's not going for it. This guy, I accidentally loaded him back in. Ooh, I should have brought some more ASFs. Didn't appreciate how good the Harriers would be now. The speed's the same, but... Not sure what he means. What specifically he is referring to. It might be something that happened over here, who knows. I need to get my zone back. See this. But yeah, I lost all my infantry that's over here, but at least we know he's not here, otherwise this would be dead now, right? He's trying to drop behind me. He's trying to get more guys over here. Uh, I could move this, but I mean, to what ends? It supplies for these others. It supplies for everybody, really. Oh yeah, I have the fob. Oh, I'm all over the place. No muscle memory, right? I have to reload my game. So he's loaded this up, so we can't put these guys here anymore. We'd have to put them here. Come on, use your grenade launcher. What's the range? 425. See how that goes for you. Well, he's probably not going to win against all that, though. Although, no, he's not. He's, he's probably already dead. There we are. At least we see him. Get that like that. We've got his resupply now. Infantry definitely dies faster. I only fought another RM70. I'm so happy. Need to get out now. We've lost that salient. Uh, could use a SPV there in case he tries to push further. Unload, please. Right, so we got a zone back. So we got 20 minutes left to win this, uh, but we are down a lot. So let's start moving up here now. In fact, let's, let's do this. And if that makes it, although I think there's, yeah, there's a mine there. <laughs> I shall hit you with this, and then I shall move up and try the same again, but closer. Use some of our helo advantage. Right, I've got Shulker for that. I've got lots of Shulkers for that. Uh, I think we're out of range, though. Oh, 
That's the RM70. Fire is really fast. It's very cool. I like it. So there's somebody in here. Like a wombat looking thing, but I don't know. Does second get the wombat? Yeah, it does. It does. I've seen it in the view. So. There it is. He's a bit more infantry here, I guess. And uh, yeah, he's trying to helo drop me, but but nothing. My guys aren't here. Is he going to back off or is he just going to land? If he lands it, yeah. So. Let's up here. Obviously, the air mobile is going to mess me up. Wholesale. Yeah, it was a one bat. So, this is all looking pretty clean now. I'll send this first, obviously, but then uh, send this behind. Just cleanse this area. Let's go. Whoops. Oh, that was a mistake. Just giving him some free supply to heal up his SAS. Wasn't very intelligent. Yeah, okay, Cub, she's using a lot of air. Could use some long range anti. Anti him. That's uh, where I'm a lance off. Uh, uh, I can get this guy across, maybe. And yeah, the spag's definitely better. Wait, you saw that. <laughs> Need some tanks or something. Curious is the same on that. So that looks clean to me. Famous last words. Mind well, just unloads. Doesn't have to be pretty. Let's just shore this up a little bit. He's routed, which is nice. But that Kali 2 is going to have something to say. That's the SAS again, isn't it? So I need to clean this as well. And it turns out there is somebody over here. Unless he just died. I think I just, might have just gone. <laughs> oh, yeah. Seed. Ah. So the, seed, the seed's better now. And uh, my micro on the seed's terrible because I'm, I'm not had to do it in ages. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, it's still not perfect. You can't, you can't fly around like that. <laughs> so, still got the SAS there, which is difficult to deal with. Ammo explosion, I was quite lucky. Oh no, he sees the CV. Or at least maybe he was targeting the Igloos that was next to CV. Either way, it's dead. Last CV, Ramirez. So I'm still plus one, but uh, better to be doing a little bit better than that. Get these guys up here. Some supply. Uh, yeah. Can't contest that Milan, just needs to sit down here. And yeah, this is not looking up. You expect him to be better late game with his additional challenges, I don't know if you can see that. Additional challenges, I should have used smoke a bit more, and my RM70 I haven't been having it firing enough. Uh, yeah, whatever. See if that doesn't. We can finally try and get this SAS out of here. That will help us a lot. A great deal. Joker destroyed. Right. So we're losing the center pretty decisively here. I never used my faggots. It's not on that side. Uh, okay. What's that going to shoot? The MP1. Go for it, mate. So, so, it's doing something. It's doing more than it does in vanilla. <laughs> <laughs> so that's low cohesion now, which is good news. And we hit some of those aeromobiles as well. Oh, that's not good. So I can't resupply my guys anymore. Over here, we're going to try and get this guy around to that. Oh, that's not good. Right, so we need seeds. 
followed by HE. That's probably the only way of doing it. Let's make sure that this guy can shoot, because right now he can't. I don't know how well he's going to fare against that challenger. If we can hit the challenger, that would be great news. I don't know if bomber values have been changed at all. There it is. The siege should be in front. And it is. So we hit it. There's a lot of dead things over there to me. Got so many. Got so many Harriers. <laughs> oh, having a really bad time here. There's a lot of those are phantoms. And uh, yeah, that needs to go out now. Just can't stay there. So get him round to here. Round to here. Where's that mortar? Hmm. So here would be good. We can get that smoke out. I don't know how fast that's going to be. Trying to get that CV. That's it though. He's moved it. Oh, he's got two. Okay. Oh! Did they used to get Carl Gustavs? I could have sworn it was something else before. <laughs> this guy is not hidden. <laughs> I'm not spending my points enough. The Shilk had died. I'll go to that seed from a while bit. Uh, my seed's back up, but I can't afford an AT plane, but now I can. So that's the plan. Still plus two, but it's not really sustainable. I need to move through this so that the challenger doesn't shoot me, but he was he turned to face a challenger and then turned back and that's how that happened. With artillery being better, you can do this now. It's fair. So we got Rafe here, I have to say. It's all javelins and stuff. Which is obviously can't really deal with that with what we have. Uh but now that that I don't know if we got that challenger. Let's all find out. See, it looked like he smoked, but I don't know if the missile hit before he hit so I don't, I don't see anything. But yeah, I could hear engine sounds. Oh, this was a mistake. Never mind. All skill. And get this guy up to here, that'd be really useful for me. Snipers are really annoying. I wonder if he can, uh, what's better? Rockets. Right, so that's going to be a problem if he gets close enough. Uh, find another cub. And we could use a supply. Don't know if this will actually get there. Oh, so that challenge has survived. Still alive. That's bad news. But he's not got smoke. Uh, the seed's repairing though, so not the best thing ever. That's sad, that's very sad. And now we can't see him anymore. Uh, okay. So now I see a fire. That's how we miss with our missile there. Huh. It's lagging a bit. Right, hopefully we got him. I don't know, I can hear an engine. I can hear an engine. And I don't see a, a flaming wreck of Calendar, so yeah, he's still alive. Still in there somewhere? Uh, where's my Shilka? <laughs> Kinda needs to be here now. Yeah, he's trying that again. I've not been firing my RM-70. Right, that's good, so we got him. We're plus two, we just need to keep it up for a bit longer. His infantry's gaining ground, but... 
Let's see, I get destroyed. That's there. Could have used this being moved up. Interesting, at low cohesion, the fights still take a long time, which is good. That's sensible. I agree with that. I really need this. That's not good. I don't know if we can see this now. Just have to get it in here. Optics are still bad on those. I lost this. That ah, just got killed by artillery, yeah. That's what happens when artillery gets better. And that was my last CV. So, uh, I'm totally fucked. <laughs> I can't go back into the game, I only brought four CVs. I should have anticipated that with artillery being better, that's going to happen more often. Because I've lost two to artillery now. Um, how do we win? We need to take center, that's literally it. That's dead. Okay. Insufficient shell velocity. Use something like this. So the only way I can win now is to retake center in the next nine minutes, otherwise I'm gonna lose. Guess these guys are in grenade launcher range or what have you. So yeah, retake I mean he's he's overextended a lot. So we've got a pretty good chance. That's seed again, isn't it? So I wish I'd brought more fires. Uh, one more cub and then just get all my AA now and just keep it switched off. That's so annoying, dude. So it must be in this building here. So, pretty sure I'll be over here. What? No, that was the wrong one. Wrong way around. Oh, that's exciting. So I wanted to turn on my air. It looks like I've done that. If I had a CV, could get it in here, but I don't. I got one CV left. And I've really only got myself to blame for that. Right. Seed out first. HE behind. I'm going to try and spot that challenger if he's still there. I think he's been moved back to there. I don't see it, whatever it is. Didn't see the challenger. Range on that's still the same. Hmm. Okay, so our last bet is... Um, Oh, right, well, we've lost the game now. We've just lost another CV to artillery. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, GG. Should have brought more CVs. Let's have a look at that kill list. But, yeah, the mod's interesting. It's got a lot of good stuff in it. So, yeah, uh, Gunther's rank 49th. You know, he's not a bad player. Um, yeah, Shilkas are better now. Lots of things better. Lots of things different. An interesting, uh, interesting mod. I'll see if he's up for a game two. I'll try playing second. So there you go. M107A2. First CV. I guess the other one killed the other ones. Difficult to deal with challenges as fourth at the best of times. Second CV. But hang on, because I lost the one. I lost the one in the small zone, and I lost two in the big zone to artillery. So I'm not sure why I only see. Oh no, hang on, there's an L21 here. So yeah, I should have done some counter battery. I didn't get a chance to use the smirch. I just couldn't afford it. So couldn't see how good that was. But yeah, the Harry is definitely way better, way better. You saw he was just uh, diving me with the seed and stuff. And eight SAS, very difficult to shift eight SAS. So. Second's a way better division now, and um, fourth isn't too shabby. I mean, I brought too much stuff in MI twos. I was just testing that, but uh, that was an overinvestment in MI twos, and my strategy was quite weak, really.
So yeah, should have brought my CVs. Definitely will for game two, if there's going to be a game two. GG well played. 17 APM Lamar.